Alright, it's now time to put your search strategies and your techniques to use. We've gone and chosen our topics for our writing uh, reports. And what we need to do now is have that report notes document open and have a Google search bar open as well. Go and do that and then return. So what we're going to do is take your topic and you're going to brainstorm keywords that relate to your topic and what you actually want to find. Write down a list, uh, write your topic down and then write down a list of keywords <coughs> that you could use that in the Google search engine. Prioritize those keywords to use first. Make sure you use the keywords in your search and then reorder them if it doesn't work or add more or change them. Um, so go and do that and then return back and we'll continue. So again, did you type in in the search engine and did you have a spell spelling error? Then Google will give you a spell check and it says did you mean? And so click on that option and that will change your search a little bit. Now when you're searching there's oftentimes there's synonyms for your search or for the word. This little symbol is called a tilde and that tilde is right next to the one and you hold the shift key to use it and what it does is if you typed in car engine in your search engine and got a multiple list of results and you would get images as well however with this tilde it will give you synonyms for the word car engine or the words and it will remove all the images from there so that way you get just web, web results Try typing that in with your actual topic. Some of your topics, remember, are the American history, etc. Now, another thing you can do is type in what you want and then minus what you don't want. So, if you see here, as you see here, it says salsa recipe minus tomatoes. And here's a reminder. When you write salsa re recipe, put a space, and then put your minus sign, but don't put a space after the minus sign. Keep the word right with it, and then type your word. So that will take away anything that you don't want. For instance, if you want, this is asking for a salsa recipe without tomatoes. And again, now these are quotation marks. Remember these. This can give, use them. You, this can help you when you want an exact search. So if you wanted Martin Luther King, you put that in parentheses and that will give you an exact search for what you're looking for.